everyone knows Washington has a spending problem. What they don't understand is, if we don't fix it as a country, we're on the road to ruin. Right now, we have a deficit of $1.3 trillion and are borrowing $58,000 every second, more than most Americans make. And if we continue down the administration's path, we'll still have a deficit of a trillion dollars 10 years from now, and we'll owe the rest of the world twice what we owe it right now. That's a path for our children to have a smaller economy, a reduced standard of living, and a big credit card bill. The only way to change trajectory is to spend less. But the sad truth is, we can't do it with 61 billion here or one less aircraft carrier there. We have to take on the very large spending programs, Social Security, Medicare, Medicaid, and the new Affordable Care Act, which we just can't afford. To do that, we need the kinds of reforms that House Republicans are talking about in their budget resolution. Those reforms would take on both the budget costs, the huge spending that we promised, and fix those programs so they deliver better retirement income, deliver better health care, and survive for our next generation. That's the task that faces us, entitlement reform that fixes the spending problem, fixes the programs, and saves our economy.